happening everybody and welcome welcome to tonight's show tonight is going to be grim like i'm not going to lie to you um i've been digging through this russian site uh just check where rachel is where is she she behind me i have no idea where is the mouse all right so stream deck come on son change the scene pal uh, why? Why always at the start of streams have you got to do this? Like, all right. Well, apparently we're going to just stay on this. We're just going to stay on this until Stream Deck decides to wake its ass up. But I've been going through this Russian site, um, looking at basically starting from the front page, going through it, and it 100% masks itself as a legitimate site that's the first thing we need to hang on a second i just need to reset the stream stream labs thing uh that's the first thing we need to look at right is the fact that this is a legitimate platform right with users on here that just want to talk about like freaking architecture architecture you know uh but in amongst it all is this weird community whether it's photographers and I'm, i'll tell you now as well a percentage of the stuff that makes us all ill to look at none of that a lot of it's going to turn out to be like gymnasts and photographers of gymnasts and all the rest of it and a percentage of that will be legitimate things did you see what i mean so what we need to do is we need to put aside the rage that we automatically get when we see like a girl, a little girl in her leotard or whatever. And we need to focus on identifying what we think are people in distress that are trafficked individuals, that are kids who have possibly been abused and that to me is the goal that we're going to take from this because I want to get to the shout outs in a minute. I'm just trying to figure out why my stream deck's not working because that is really fucking annoying. I'm going to just restart it one more time. Oh, also, but just before we get started, yeah, I know, I know. <laughs> I will be on the screen in a second. I will be on the screen in a second. The the fancy little thing that I have that I push the buttons on that makes all the stuff happen is uh, 
having a freaking fit to itself right now, so I'm just restarting it. So, I don't know, I heard today, uh, I don't know if this is old news, but apparently HBO are making a series out of The Last of Us, the game, which would obviously be amazing. Oh my God, why? Why is this not working, like, for fuck's sake? Right, you guys might have to just bear with me for a second or two. Also, my hair's a bit wet. I've just been in the bath. Come on. All right, we're just getting a bunch of warnings now. Okay, just give me a couple more minutes of fiddling around with this, and then I'll just have to go to manual mode. What a fucking pain in the balls. All right, just give me a minute. So basically, the reason this is a pain in the ass is the basically the software that I use for controlling this stream has just decided to go kaput. So I need to just restart the stream deck again. And the reason the stream deck is important is because there's so much on these these screens that it's it's still legal what you what I'm looking at here, but it's not. To YouTube's terms of service basically and cutting between the pages clicking on the, the the screen is a nightmare so just bear with me I do apologize actually what I could do though is while I'm trying to fix this is just manually do this hey hey, hey! my hair is a bit fucking wet I've just come out of the bath I do apologize what do you think of the new setup <laughs> Uh, I need to adjust the color. I look really red, so I do apologize if I look like I've been slapped about the place. And my hair is wet because I was just in the bath and I'm now tangled in cables. I've realized as well, ever since I started doing the broadcasting uh, side of content, I fucking hate cables, like, with a passion. Like, I hate them with a passion. And I'm sorry to do this to you. Uh, I hate them with a passion. Okay, so as always, I've not been mentioning it, and people have been asking, but Razorwire, hunt a killer, use code Rowan. Links are down in the description. We're legit. People back us. We know what we're doing here. Uh, all right, let's start up this again. Let's see what we're doing. Yeah, the hair, the hair's wet. I do apologize, everybody. It was just. Uh, I got in the bath late because I keep going down these weird weird rabbit holes on this let's see all right so apparently oh wait no that doesn't make any sense nah all right okay well fuck you stream yard how about that all right okay looks like we're going to be doing this manually so you <laughs> you guys are in for a, a slow process this evening Okay, so the first... Oh, man, I need to move this over here. This is just a pain in the ball sack. Okay, now where is everything? Press 
Preston Carway. Keep up the good work in exposing these disgusting people around the world and these folks like you. Thank you, Preston. I really appreciate that. Um, I really do. I really do appreciate that. I fucking. Why did that? Why did that? Why did that not appear on the screen? Like, do we not have a chat box here? Okay, Ron. Ron's just tweaking some things on this screen here. You need to. You need to forgive him for his. Okay, is this the right chat, or is this just? Oh my god. Source. Okay. Okay. Error. Oh, we're getting errors now. Okay, great. That's that's super, man. That's super awesome. So apparently nothing's linking to this either. All right. So let's just take a look first of all at the page that we discovered this site with and even though I know this isn't working I'm still pushing the buttons is this the right one okay all right so we did the reverse image search of the the, the little girl that I had seen on that the fuck's it called uh, Instagram last year okay so we'll go through this, right? And obviously, there's a fair percentage that looks suspicious. Fuck my mother, so hot. All right, beautiful and a very suspicious. See, this is this is where we get really suspicious when you have what look like little girl's thighs. Do you know what I mean? This account, right? This one here. This one right here. This one right here very bizarre like it basically is posing as being a little girl selling custom content of herself very weird so i just want you to know the next stage is contacting these people all right so again this is the same girl this is the same girl looks a bit suspicious Suspicious. I'm just talking to the people. Okay, so you can see this is all the responses to these images and all the rest of it. Very disturbing. Agreed? Agreed, Ron. Okay. Let's move forward with our part of this lecture. Uh, oh, also, big announcement. Uh, all you fans of the uh, the second channel, we have got a new end of the news format coming. All right, it is coming. Um, the second channel is going to be all the content that I want to make on the first channel, but it's just not it's just not worth everyone telling me that I should just stick to catching predators and not talk about other things. So I'm just going to just going to appease the masses there. But that's coming back and uh, it's going to be a mix of the old format where it was current news and events and shit but i'm throwing in a bit of youtube stuff as well because uh, yeah okay so back on our lovely site if we go like we learned last time if we go to the main search and we just click on the kids section all right there's a couple with emails now you just need to take my word for it that there was albums updated one minute ago but the, uh, the albums have email addresses on them. Okay, so, you know, fun summer pools and play. Some are fun of all types. Fairly innocent. Could just be somebody having a pool party, you know? Then we get down to ModHap, okay? Now, just remember this little image down here, okay? Again, none of this is illegal. All of this is totally legal. What you're looking at here okay is family images that have been data mined or stolen from facebook you've got gymnastics possibly photographers you will have legitimate photographers in here okay but the point is in amongst all of this you are going to have exploited children and very possibly trafficked children now i just want to give you an example okay of the sort of image that raises suspicion for me okay have a look. So, for me, 
all right? This is very concerning. Because at first glance, it looks like a hotel room that's been had two, two, two beds pushed together. And for me, there's a very big, 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 big difference between that. Uh, I can't. And literally the rest of the images in this guy's folder. They're all different kids, okay? They're all in folders marked girlies. And most of them have one really suspicious image. Like, really suspicious image. This being one of the most concerning ones that I've found so far. And this... Ah, oh, fuck. Okay, this to me looks awfully and this was this was posted tonight okay so this is posted this evening like what the fuck is going on there do you see what i mean it's only one image it's one image in amongst a whole folder okay but Look at all the folders this guy has. See them all. Like, so if this guy's got all these folders and in each folder, there's one or two images that really make me think, holy shit, that's quite possibly a traffic child. That's a pattern. That's a consistent pattern, all right? I'm not going to show it on YouTube, but there's a girl, there's a picture of a girl, totally clothed, totally clothed, all right, nothing naked about this girl, and she's got what in her hand looks like a long blue cylinder in her mouth, all right, and again, this folder is full of different kids, all either on the beach or at the pool. It's weird. So, let me get the chat back up. So for me, the stage that I'm at with this is we need to now start identifying suspect accounts, all right? I'm not gonna waste my time with a guy who's got 500 pictures of 12-year-old girls in neck to ankle leotards doing gymnastics. I'm probably just gonna say that's something to do with gymnastics. Once we've got rid of all the really fucked shit, then we'll worry about the weird old gymnastic collectors. Deal? Deal? Does that make sense? I just need you to understand the workflow of this. And, you know, just one individual. Well, it's not one individual. It's just shit like this is what I deal with. And I don't really like spreading this out in the community, so. It is fucked up. Is this working now? No. Is that's working though? So why is that happening? Why is this happening? Why? 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 Hmm? You were working. In oh, fact, no. I, I know it's working because it was working earlier. So I'm not gonna, not gonna deal. Okay, great. Okay. So with that work method in mind. What we're gonna do is we're gonna focus on this motherfucker. And again, I just wanna make it very clear, there is nothing here that you would say is illegal. Oh, fuck. There's nothing here what you would say is illegal. Nothing, okay? It all looks like mind images from people's holidays. I'll give you an example of what I mean. Here's an example of what I mean. I'd rather not put this little girl's face 
though, because this is literally, she is not a model, this is just, let me just chuck this over her head here. In fact, let me just chuck this over this part of her body as well, so that we're fully, yeah. oh fuck, now we've got that. Anything up there that's worrying? No. Okay, so you can see, I'm sorry this takes so long without the box. So you can see, this is just a little girl fishing, little girl fishing, totally innocent, probably taking off her dad's Facebook. Do you see what I mean? And, and when I say taking off her dad's Facebook, I don't mean, I mean a lot of the time, sure, you're going to get some creeps going through Facebook taking these. But there's software that's just mining this shit. Like, trust me, it's just mining away. It's fucking nuts. So, if you want to get an idea of how important source code is for programming and for anything at all, just look into the, the CSGO and the Team Fortress source code leak that's gone on just now and how that's affected the players. Like you're talking ten, mil, hundreds of thousands, if not millions of players stop playing because of the risk from hackers to their entire life through a computer game, all right? So trust me, trust me, okay? These computer game companies spend way more money than, you know, startups and tech companies that have just started up do when it comes to uh, security for, if you download a third party app or any of this shit, it's just, there's so much, if you click on the wrong pop-up, it's just amazing what a 14 year old computer programming Russian kid can do these days. It's fucking terrifying. Okay, so, we're gonna continue going through this. Again, I would like to reiterate multiple times, none of this is illegal content. It's, it, it's extremely disturbing. Why? Oh, see. All right. Oh man. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna cover this girl's face because this this one it's like she's staring into my fucking soul. Can you guys tell me what you notice about this? Tell me what stands out to you. Tell me what fucking stands out to you in this one image in amongst. 25 other images of girls in bikinis on holiday. What stands out on this image to you? Where's the suspicious? What's what's the suspicious part of this? You get a gold star if you can spot it. What do you think? Oh, is the music too loud? Is the music too loud? Shit. Sorry, everybody. Sorry about that. Sorry, 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 sorry. It's these fucking headphones. The pause. How about the 50% off? Fifty percent off. Fifty percent off. Little girls. Fifty percent off now. What the actual fuck? So. Oh man. Haunting. 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 Do you know what? We're reversing that one. Oh man. Right, I just want to say I'm downloading that one image with the 50% price tag and uh, we're going to go and chuck it into an image search. Please, 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 please. Like... Sorry, this is so slow, everybody. 
Once I get uh, the new system in a few weeks, probably five, six weeks, and we'll have a new system. What the fuck are you doing, mate? Like, like, why are you in downloads? Like, what? What are you doing? There it is, right. Oh, God. Okay. Okay, good. All right, so it didn't come back with any other search results, okay? Which means if this is organized crime, it's taken place within this server or somewhere else heavily encrypted. And this was up. This this image was added five days ago. All right, let's keep digging through these. Hang on, I need to jazz time for a minute, guys. I can't. I, I don't even know where the button is. Oh man. All right. All right. So, all right. Okay. 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 So, girls 54, suspicious image. Girls 55, suspicious image. Girls 53, suspicious image. Let's just keep working through this bundle of joy. See, what the fuck is going on here? What in the actual fuck is going on here? All right. Okay, I'm going to have to try and edit a bit of this out as well. Okay, I would like to say this little girl is completely clothed. All right, I'm just... I'm just covering up all... I'm just covering this bit up. Like, I mean, fuck. But actually, I can't do that because there's that up there. Because that's fucking nudists, ain't it? You fucks. All right. Oh, no, he's making that bigger. All right. Oh, man. Yeah, I suppose as long as we cover up that bit. Oh, man, I don't really want a fucking short face, though. This is like the jankiest way. This is literally the jankiest, like, editing of a person ever. Okay, so, like I say, she's totally clothed. She looks about six or seven. And this is the image that is on here. That's me. Hi, how are you? Fucking hell. All right, do you see what I'm saying? You seen this shit? You seen this fucking shit? Alright, I had enough of that shit, I'll tell you that much. Okay, okay, what was that? That was girls 51. Alright, let's girls 50. Let's let's see what's in here. can be happening okay okay that's root beer again all kids holiday holiday happy smiley sandcastle swimsuity no normal thing like normal pictures you would take of your kids on holiday totally normal but none of these are his kids. At all. What in the actual fuck? Oh, also, there is some really disturbing pop ups. All right. So if I click on something and all of it sounds like it sounds like someone's getting sh ramshanked, okay, it's the pop up. All right. That is a really suspicious image. But again, it's, why would you take why would you take that picture of your own kid, Ron? Think about this as a parent. Okay. Would you take a picture of your daughter aged six seven eight ish in a t-shirt climbing out of the pool 
with no bottoms on. You can just see her bum. But why would you take that? Why would you take that picture? And her face, she's looking away as well. Which is another alarm bell. All right. All right. This fucker. This fucker. All right. Congratulations, buddy. Congratulations. Let's go and start ripping apart your life. Okay. Let's, um, let's dive in to some more examples of this. I tell you something else, man. The amount of malware that is on this fucking site is unreal. Like, it is unreal. You click on anything and it's like warning bells just screaming through the computer. Okay. Yes, till they're 50. Yes, yes. I'm thinking the only way right now, hear me out here, okay? This is an actual legitimate suggestion for dealing with pedophiles, right? You're just going to have to have like a 18 year pregnancy. Any thoughts? <laughs> I mean, I'm not saying it's practical, okay? But that would that would stop it overnight. Boom. It'd be done. There'd be no more. There'd be no more. It would just be people would really think about getting pregnant as well, because that's a long bun in the oven. Do you know what I mean? Do you know what I mean? Imagine having like an 18 year old just mulling about and so anyway, I, I, moving on. We're moving on. Okay, so I'm scrolling back through these images. All right. Scrolling, 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 scrolling. It seems like endless images. And then you remember there's 1,100 pages of endless images. There's that motherfucker right there again. So, um, okay, motherfucker, I'm I'm down, I'm down. So this guy, this guy, this guy, this guy. Yeah, this fucking guy. That, that is a hundred percent. trafficked fucking girl or something there's something really wrong about to happen in this image okay and we do have a f yeah okay so this motherfucker is super high tigger how are you doing Okay, let me give you this guy's tagline on his profile. Write to me if you want more interesting photos of girls, okay? And the image... Oh, what have we done with it, Ron? Okay, this is all like sea of nightmares. Okay. Okay. All right. So this guy here, this guy here, this guy right here, this guy, this guy here. All right. We need to deal with this guy. This is going to be our focus now. He's got, we've got email addresses. This is a nightmare scenario. Let me just. Before I show you this, just give me a second. Cover all this shit up. Like, literally, the only thing that I'm able to show on this is about this much of the image. And I can tell you right now, this motherfucker has more pictures of this girl. And 
I know this because he's bragging about it on his fucking profile. You're the one. You are our new project, buddy. And the reason you're our new project is you updated fucking those images three hours ago and you have 42 albums. You're the one. All right, this is the one. So this is going to be our little project now. Motherfucker. Oh, man. What the fuck is that? What does that mean? So this is what the guy's email has been made with. To Tanota. To no, to, I don't fucking know what that says. Secure email. Great. wonder what uh, terrible decisions you've been making online with this. Oh. Oh, no. All right. All right. Yeah, this guy here, this is the one. Write to me if you want more interesting photos of girls. Oh, man. See, his albums are the same. It's just girls 20 to 1 to 43. That is also a bit concerning. All right. Now, see, literally any time I see a young girl up against what looks like a sheet or a bed sheet that's been pinned to the wall, alarm bell. I want to reverse that. Mm. See, I can, right? These, like, it just, this could be a totally innocent image. It just fucking weirds me out how badly lit the room is. Do you know what I mean? Badly lit room. Oh. oh I'm, maybe I'm being too cynical. Maybe it's just like, back in war-torn Slovakia land. I don't fucking know. Right. Okay, so we've got we've got our sniper set on somebody. Let's just get all this documented. Give me that T as well. Hello there, T. What am I doing? Okay, but where is that? All right. I don't think it is. The voice is in my head. Ha ha! See? Ha ha! I was right. <laughs> I'm gonna fucking show you. I think you're fucking smart. Yeah. All right. Dun 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 dun. Oh god! I would just love to take like. I would. I would love to just. Love it. Dun, dun, dun. No, 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 no fucking, no fishing naughtiness for me. Cakes, thank you very much. Sorry, I don't know why none of these are coming through on my screen. Probably because you broke it, Ron. Probably right, Ron. 
Our birthday was good. I'm going to come into the side chat in just a minute because I love you guys. Just give me a second. All right. I hate this. I hate this. Like, hang on a second. That's a bit fucking bare. All right, get the fucking toxicity protectors on. Right, we've got this motherfucker tied down, right? No, that's a different guy. It's this guy. Yeah, give me all that, right? Give me all that. And just to make sure you haven't totally fucked all this up, pal, we'll just copy the raw fucking information as well for when you've inevitably screwed this up, Ron. Good idea, Ron. Yeah, well. Almost fucking 70,000 subscribers now, Ron. Might want to buck up, lad. You're right. Okay, so... Like, write to me if you want. This is literally in every single one of the... The albums of these little girls. Young girls. Is his email. If you want me to get more interesting photos... I wonder if we just took that whole sentence and Googled that with his email, where else he's been putting that. Oh, Nailed it. All right. Why, why am I getting returns on that though? I don't understand. Uh, yeah, also, yeah, I do apologize. Um, all the links for this channel are down below. The uh, Razor Wire Energy Hunt a Killer. Use code Rowan to save yourself some pennies. The uh, tip donations, Patreon merch, all that nonsense is also in there. Go and check it out. Go and check out my video on the fucking YouTuber who thought it would be I to go to jail for producing child porn, and then he thought he'd come out of jail after 14 years. Use other images. Oh, that's a good line. That's a good lad. Yeah, we'll get to that. I don't really want to be downloading too much, to be honest. I've got, so I've got, I've got the fucker now. Now what I just need to know what I need to do now. <laughs> yeah, I think, uh, I think I'm just going to hand this over to a couple of people. And let them do their thing. <clears throat> their resources are way higher than mine on digital kung fu, kung fuery, mm. basically. What a bunch of wee dicks, though. Wee fucking dicks. All right, so we can close that. Let's find some. Oh, for the love of fucking fucking fuck. Okay, give me that as well in case we lose that. That is so fucked up. Like this, like this, it's just so fucked up. You're going the fuck down, motherfucker. Thank you, Tigger. Oh man, and this fucker, this fucker. This fucker right here. Yes. You're going as well. Is this the same fucking guy? No, this was the guy that didn't have the email, was it? So, what is your crack then, pal? If you're updating images, right? Let's... Let's assume... What was your name? Was it Gamer? It was Gamer, right? What the fuck was your name? Oh, 123Gamer. What is happening? Right. I'm going to take what that suspect... Remember the image of the girl sleeping on the bed? Let's go and see what we can pull from that. Dun, 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 dun. Well, oh, where the fuck have you put the image, mate? Oh, <sighs> 
literally not a fucking clean as a whistle nothing not even camera data not even camera data if that makes everybody else just as concerned and sickened as i am i'm doing the 50 percent off one nap absolutely stripped as well and let's do let's do let's do a random image off my desktop all right okay well that was a shitty fucking I'm coming to the side chair in just a second, guys. I can chill out for a minute. All right. Okay. Okay. No, it is. It is pulling up something, but it's. I've got a feeling that once the image has gone to this site, it's made a copy of it and added its own data to erase any data that would have been there because the file name only exists because of the URL from the site it came from, if that makes sense. But again, this isn't, this isn't where, this isn't really a hundred percent my specialty. So. I'm doing my best right now, but like I say, once I've got something like this little f f file that I'm sending off, you know, it's it's massive now. Okay, zombie and stuff. Okay, okay. Right, I'm gonna grab my ciggy and I'm gonna, I'm gonna come and jump into the side chat. I just want to close everything that could possibly get me banned. We'll just keep this original. I'll uh, I'll let you enjoy some more of the. Uh, oh no! Fuck it! Fuck it! Let's just go jazz time for a fucking minute so I can chill out. Oh, right, where is my lovely side chat? Local bottom. Morgan's here. My name's Jeff. Rabbit Pepe. Mary, what has happened? What's happening? Mary, aka Kayona UK. Zanuza down the bar. Oh, Tigger's here. Tigger's here. Morgan Riley show what is happening. Harry Dick, feel it, feel it, feel it. Local bottom and Von Moogle, Ellie Van Zandabar is still here. Rug ups, the Lone Project, Harry, Rainy Artwork, Trisha Barr. What is happening? And Von Moogle, Rose is here. My name is Jeff, still here too. A redacted and contained. What is happening? What is happening? Harry's here. Ellie's here. Ah, oh, it's everybody. Miranda's here too. Ronald, oh, it's everyone. It's a whole bunch of people. What's happening? Eiko's here too. Yeah. Jessica, Aaron, Dragul, Blackberry. What's happening? All right. Hmm. Okay. So we now know that we have suspicious images that we've located. Uh, Solway. No, you're amazing, Solway. You. You. I thank you very much for that. I don't know why it doesn't play the super chats. Hey, why you do that? Let me just go to this alert box and see what the fuck's going on with this thing. Hi. Oh, what do you mean? Oh, is that what that is? You're such a fucking dick, computer. Like, why? Why? Why do you have to be like that? All right. So I think now that should work. What a fucking pain in the balls you are, computer. All right. So that next time someone does a sticker or a super chat, we should get some sort of reaction. If we don't, you have the my permission to just punch this whole YouTube channel in its in its face. Facey Dale punch punch. 
telling you, though. Hey, it's a good turnout. Thank you, everyone, for your support. Stop ripping your hair out with the brush. Yeah, she says that to me all the time. All the time. I'm telling you. I can't believe the stream deck's been a wee dick as well. well you, you have one fucking job. Preston, we'll see if this works. Give me the fucking alert, you mother... Listen. Nah, it hates us. It hates us, Preston. I appreciate you trying, though, mate. I really do. That. Ah, uh, oh well. I need to figure this out. But... Oh, hang on. Paul Phone. I also found this website on the service web that links to all the CP and animal websites and then the day into this stuff is real. And on the service web is crazy as fuck. Yeah, dude. Okay, let's just have a wee look at that. Uh, there's a shocking amount of it, dude. Like, if I'm being totally honest with you, um, Mr. Dick. It's shocking. And I've got a couple of videos that have been banned by YouTube. Well, I say banned by... Well, they were banned by you. They were taken off by YouTube. Uh, one is exposing nudist colonies and their websites and their private DVD sales. Um, and the other one is basically just going over reasons why parents torture their children on social media. Um, and I think that got banned because I showed a very blurred uh, snippet from when these Russian vigilantes caught this this guy who was attempting to rape a two-year-old but he's also a, a known pedo pedophile and people trafficker and yeah they whipped whipped to death with cable ties do you know how long that would i would uh, damn spicy all right let's uh let's jump back in to the saves from the other night all right because what I wanted... Oh, no, that's what we were going to do. We were going to do more reverse image searches. All right. More reverse image searches of the images that come up in Google. Okay. So we're still in... Okay. Like, what even... I suppose she's got a tattoo. Does that really mean anything? Puts my mind at ease a little bit. If I'm being honest. <sighs> All right. All right. Is that a bit weird? That is a bit weird, eh? All right, so I've got two more. The rest look like legitimate images for whatever reason. We're gonna let those ones just sit. All right. All right. Okay, so. Do you mean something didn't work? Oh, okay. All right, okay. Okay, let's try this one. It looks like a fairly professionally done photograph. The girl just looks suspiciously young. Doesn't come up with anything. All right, so yeah, like I say, just no. It's, okay, 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 okay. These are coming back with nothing. It was just that one. They can't. It can't have been the one in a bajil. Let's do that one again and see how shit this is. See if it lies to us. All right, so you're a piece of shit. That's what that is. Dun, 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 dun. Right, okay, that's the one, Gimlet. Right, I'm going to do the original image that got me uh, onto all of this to make sure that 
I'm not actually completely insane. Okay, yeah, that comes back with the same same results. Yeah. What the fuck? What the fuck? Give me a second. Okay, so that's you just ranting about it. Okay, is this you just ranting about it as well, Victoria? Are you just ranting about it or are you some crazy lady pedophile? No, you are. What the fuck? All right, all right. You're on the right side though. You're on the right side. That's fine. That's fine. Okay, so that is that. Okay, so let's look at these other images through this now, and then we at least know what we're going to get. So where's that first one of that little girl? There we go. Okay. Okay. Fuck. Fucking these fuck fucking motherfuckers again. Okay, great. That's brilliant. Okay, brilliant. That's that's great. That is so good, man. So cool, man. So cool that your fucking website's still up, man. Morgan, thank you. You're no, you're a legend. You are. Thank you. At least we know these are working. See, see, didn't break these ones. All right, so, wow, this, wow, talk about instant ban. There is so much, so many porn banners on this site. It is insane. Okay, so, a while back, I done uh, a video about a website called Come On Printed Pictures, okay? Now, it's exactly as it sounds. It's a community that prints off pictures cracks a nut out on them and then post pictures of their tributes okay now there's some people that put their pictures on this site to become tributes you know the it's a, it's a could be a kink thing i don't really know um there is a weird subcategory of people who do it for like revenge porn do you know what I mean? So they'll upload like a non-pornographic image of their ex's face. And then before you know it, there's like a whole bunch of dudes who've arrived on it, if you know what I'm saying. And, uh... Oh, Anne Clark! Tigger! You're a spicy wee meatball, Tigger. Spicy little meatball. Sam as well, coming in with the stickers. Thank you. I appreciate that, everybody. I really do. Um, okay. Where, where was my brain just going there? Okay, yes. These motherfuckers. Right, so. Let me just show you exactly why I'm freaking out right now. So that image of the little girl that I said that looked suspicious... Right, it didn't look, it was a professionally done photograph. Can I find it on my, my desktop is a fucking state. Oh, there it is, there we go. Okay, so this is the image that I'm talking about. Okay, could be from a professional photo shoot. Could be anything, who the fuck knows. Could be from a acting portfolio headshot thing. Don't know, okay, don't know, but when you reverse image search it, she's listed on the COPP, Come On Printed Pictures site. Which is obviously lovely. What the fuck is that? American Horror Story. Sorry, Twitter. It's my bad. I'm getting sucked into things. Okay, so... Let's do a couple more. 
Okay, so it's four plebs and COPP that that's come up on. Lovely. Lovely. It's lovely. Lovely. This one, this is another, but she, this girl's got a tattoo and she does, she could be, she could be 15, she could be 19. Okay, that's who that is. Oh man. Oh yeah, Sparks, Sparks coming in from Mixer. Appreciate that gamer, appreciate that. Okay, so this is a, a leaked celebrity nude. Celebrity Jihad, holy fucking shit, man. The guys that own this website are mental. Okay. Okay. So that is apparently a celebrity's leaked picture. That's fine. You can, you can be that. That is good. All right, so let's, dirt, let's dive back into these fucking motherfuckers. Oh my god, so much pornography. Oh! All right, okay. All right. Oh my god. It's all legal, but man, it is graphic! All right, okay. Where are the labels? Where are the labels? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, no! They're not wank. They're not, they're not. Oh, they are. They're jerking off on Barbie dolls. Wow! 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 What? Okay. What about? So I'm just doing some random keyword search. I'm sorry this is so fucking boring. Like, there's just... There's just nothing on here that I can show you right now. What the fuck? What the fuck? This is obvious. What does this mean? Simple. Post a picture of the next person says whether they keep... Wow. So this is this is this is clearly some sort of fetish shit. Like or just some I mean I don't really imagine you know people traffickers who are selling women who are happily taking photos of themselves, but I can show you this bit. I think yeah, I can show you this bit. All right, so you can see here this is the game they're playing. Post a picture and the next person says whether they'd keep the bitch as a fuck toy or sell her cunt to the highest bidder. Then post one of your own. I'll kick us off with this one as a keeper for me. Fun. It's the rapey people trafficker sex slave game. And it just goes on and on and on and on. Jesus. <laughs> just like full pictures of fully clothed adults and then just just one totally naked woman doing some crazy shit all right so what can we what are going to be the keywords on this let me see the advanced search what have we got built in keyword wise Oh, shit. Okay. This site keeps a record of the last, the last load of searches that have been done. 
and there is some pretty interesting searches one being c oh whoa Mara mary mary what is happening glad to be part of your army thank you thank you very much thank you everyone for your support um it's going on new tech thank you because this shit needs upgraded okay so we've got we've got some abbreviations and ways of typing out cp basically and i just want to make it clear just so everyone knows what it is i'm looking at right now it's this oh my god what if I, why why is your name teen rape like good okay so all right this is going to take a lot of sifting there is literally tens of thousands of posts here and they're all from like now like this is updating by the minute and i'm not saying it's all you know, I'm not saying it's all, you know, child, illegal child called blackmail, little, this is. Oh, <laughs> I was just about to show you <laughs> these tags, right? And then scrolled up to center it and there's just porn adverts everywhere. So I've, I'm giving up on that one, but. Let me let me read you some of the last searches that were made. S H A Y. Next one is jailbait. Next one is blackmail. Little feet girl. These are just, these are just, it's just, it's just women. It's just women. It's just women. That's good. That's fine. We're fine with the, I mean, obviously it's, it's not. I mean, I can't imagine any of these women know they're on here. So that's not good. But at least it's not some kids. Let me just refresh and see if we get any more search hits. Asian teen hangouts. What is that? What is that? When you get like a weird name or a weird, th like a weird sounding word. Oh. I'm not reacting to any images. I'm reacting to the titles of some things. There's a lot of like rape fantasy, like brutal rape and torture game. Sick fucks wanted. No limits. Wow, these are just women. These are just literally women from the book. Hang on, let me, let me, let me, let me. Is that not fucking, what's her name from the fucking vlog squad? What the fuck was her name? Right, okay, can I show you this? Right, we better hide her face because that's, literally could be a footballer's girlfriend and just sue my ass. Okay, so here we go, here we go. So I'm pretty sure that's the chick from the vlog squad, first of all. Brutal rape and torture game. I would grab... I'm not even going to read that. B bad things, really bad, arriving in a bad way, nothing ends well. Picture of her here, right? Oh, oh, thank you very much. Thank you very much for the donation. Why are you way up there, though? What? What's going on? Come here, alert box. Okay, so, my name's Jeff. Fucking hell, Jeff. Cheers, brother. Holy shit. Thanks so much. Thank you so much, Jeff. Thank you, everybody. I mean, that's, this is crazy. Thanks so, so much. I really, really cannot tell you. <laughs> like, I, you know, I don't want to sound like I'm moaning. About, I mean, I'm not. My life's absolutely fucking awesome. I see my kids all day. But 
a lot of mouths to feed and all of this it really really helps me try and just upgrade some of this equipment and keep the lights on i really it honestly it honestly is uh, this is my full-time job and it's you guys that make it possible so i'll keep i'll keep doing it don't you worry don't you worry so is it what then what happens do you then post first thing i would do okay so it's just they're just posting loads and loads. Wow, this guy's gone all out. Wow. This guy's gone, like, full-on Tolkien. Fucking hell. Where the fuck is the chat gone? Give me the chat. Come back over here, chat. Oh, man, it's 230 of you suffering this through this with me. I really appreciate it. So, watch Surviving Life video. By the Pizza Gate's crazy. Pizza Gate's crazy. 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 Uh, but, I mean, look at this. I mean, this is a massive one. So, let me just... Let me just do this, all right? And let's just gather our thoughts for a minute. So, why are we on COPP? Because of that girl, the, the 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 young actress's image. Okay. I just want to point out as well that this girl here. Okay, let me just cover her face because I will say obviously she is an adult. All these images about her rape fantasy have come from her Instagram. Like, these are screenshots of her stories off of her Instagram. Like, uh, if I do that, do you see? So this is somebody who has uh, a fantasy about either just rape in general or about this girl specifically. Damn, this isn't even like a super rapey community and this is some dark shit you know i mean jerk it off on people's pictures and then you know hardcore rape fantasies a bit which are much is here yeah it did start with that uh queen you're absolutely right smashed it there mate Mush, I think you should just move to Scotland. Ron, check your PayPal link on Streamlabs. Oh, shit. Something else just came through. What is happening? Hang on a second. Hang on. Tigger, Tiger, Tiger King. Yes, Tiger King. Fucking brilliant. Right, check. My name, Jeff. Streamlabs. It should be working all right. The donations are coming through. Um... Best way to send money. Uh, Daniel, what's the best way? It's through um, through this link. I'll send you it right now. If you guys click on this, right at the very top, you will see... Uh, that's the admin link, you fucking dildo. Yeah, don't click on the admin link. <laughs> click on this link. Uh, that one there, but if you've sent something through and it never appeared, let me know because I can go through this Because there's one here that I think I possibly missed right there from Larholm Swan on a people Thank you very much for your donation. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, all right, so that Wikipedia this this Twitter was nothing all right, so we need to log printed pictures and we need to log it on a search page with those fucking results. Nailed it. All right, nice one. Where's the dirt? Where's the notepad? There it is. Whew, this is getting spicy. All right, so we've now got two known child abuse content sharing bastard communities that tie in with this google tv film television thing 100 million bajillion percent so whether or not 
it's active now. It's certainly got members that were commenting on images that are active now on other communities. Does that make sense? So that means if this was like a 70s detective series, we're hot on their tail, Muggsy. I can't find Ron's video on Pizzagate. Ron's video on Pizzagate. There's <laughs> there's the, the Hope Dies Here documentary. It's like three hours long. It's got a lot about Pizzagate. Um, what else? What else has got Pizzagate in it? Most of the documents. Jessica, thank you so much. Thank you so, 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 so much, Jessica. So what would you guys like to see us do next on this? I mean, sitting, sitting, exposing is great, okay? But we really want to, like, start poking the bear a little bit now. Um, so tomorrow night, just so everybody knows, we're probably going to do, like, a community night. Um, you, got, you guys want to come and join the panel. We'll have a bit of a chitty chat. We can have a look at some fun stuff and uh, then tomorrow night we're going to be going back to the telltale games as well tonight i'm focusing on this because after i've done this i need to make a really important phone call to uh, Ico, who's helping me with some emails that need to be sent which are going to possibly lead to massive opportunities so that's why there's no gaming tonight sadly um but I don't know. I don't. I'm not one to just keep regurgitating, right? I'm happy to do any investigative streams when we're investigating new communities of these motherfuckers. I don't just want to keep delving into the same ones. I want to action is what's needed next. So Elsa Gate. <laughs> Fuck! How fucked up was Elsa Gate? That was so fucked up. Oh man. Oh man. Elsa Gate, right, was basically right before all of the outcry about YouTube kids happened, right? When all the comment sections got turned off and all this mad craziness was, was discovered where you had people dressing up as Disney characters and then the thumbnails, it was like Elsa goes to the doctors and gets an injection. And it's like... Elsa injecting dolls with needles and into their ass and kids getting in. It was we It was fucking weird. Just Google it. It's crazy. Contact the pedos. Ghostface. I like your thinking. I'm down with that. Ghostface, mate. That's what we do. Like, yeah, uh, you should go and watch the interview in a deep web child molester video I done. Do you know how many fucking monsters? Whether it's pedophiles, fucking murderers, torturers. I've spoken to all of them, and. This summer, I have got a massive new project for interviewing evil, I think is where I'm going to be going with it. Interviewing evil. I think so. Uh, and I'm basically going to go and try and find the worst currently free predators, abusers, killers, torturers, animal crushers, all that shit, and give them a standardized set of questions, okay? and turn the whole thing in a textbook so you're reading through 50 cases that are all given the same answers to the same questions from 50 different psychotic mindsets probably shouldn't be giving away my ideas uh, oh jessica jessica con constantine that is a very fancy name jessica constant it sounds like a superhero or a, maybe it sounds like a couple of superheroes that got married and then had a kid and called it Jess. Maybe it's like Con maybe it's Jessica Jones and Constantine married. Fucking nailed it. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, what what was I talking about again? Oh, the book. Yes, that's what I was talking about. Interviewing evil. Yeah. Yeah. They're fucked up. I mean, they won't put them all in the book. Some of them will be coming onto the content world. Obviously. You know what I'm saying. Uh, and it's kind of a book that writes itself which is good because ron and his words <laughs> so yeah yeah i've decided i woke up this morning after turning it was my birthday yesterday right I woke up this morning and i'm like i am not fucking going to my next birthday this is not going to be the same i'm going to take this to the next level by next year and whether that Preston, here's some more money. For, thank you, Preston. <laughs> thank you very, very much. Honestly, it's 
Thank you. I really do appreciate it, Preston. I appreciate all of this. Um, I really, really do. And and like I say, the next thing to happen is this PC getting replaced. And once the PC is replaced, brand new outdoor studio. It's going to be fucking lit. And uh, I was really concerned about getting it, um, getting affording it. And I'm PayPal and a few other things. Uh, are funding a lot of it and I'm, I'm really excited um because i always doubt i always doubt that things are going to i'm ever going to accumulate money because every time i'm saving anything like all the children suddenly need shoes or something happens or this breaks or but do you know what i mean you know your parents you know what i'm fucking saying you know what i'm saying uh, amy sweetheart thank you so much for that one up sticker thank you how about cannibalism in colonialism Colonialism? Colonialism? That's the past, right? Colonialism is the past, right? That's a period, isn't it? Forty-nine and that's enough for a new deal. It is, yeah. I do like fancy ones. Do you know what I mean? If they can't like uh, at least whisk an egg afterwards, I'm not interested. Do you know what I'm saying? Uh, but deep web, more content. It's all coming. It's all coming. Um, but I just want to keep delving into this just for a little bit more. Just for a little bit more. What the fuck? English lessons. That's what you need, pal. Let's just think about this. Oh, do you know what I think we'll do? I think, uh, cut your hedges, Rod. Yes. Uh, yeah, there's... Actually, it's funny you say that. Um... You may, well, are you making any videos on deep web cannibalism or cannibalism? I can do a, I can do a cannibalism video, yeah. Why not? Um, what, I'd, what I would say, though, is I'd rather not cover the hits. You know what I mean? German guy, Cannibal Cafe, ate his pal. Um, I might talk a little bit about cannibalism in... I don't know. I'll find, I'll find an angle. I'll find an angle. No problem. Don't, no problem. Bit of cannibalism is fine. Um, it might be tied in with a bunch of things, if I'm being honest. Like, it might be Surface Web Horrors 3, where we look at some cannibal stuff. We look at some other fucking horrific shit that's all on Google, basically. Um, yeah, fine with that. It's no problem. It's no problem. Uh, I, would quite, I was quite wanting to do a video showcasing how budget um, horror, when given out of context is very easy to manipulate into a deep web myth if that makes sense Does that makes sense i'm just going to go to jazz time just for a second as well so for example like doing a 30 minute video where i give you three 10 minute scenarios that uh maybe i would do five and i would have one of them being a real scenario and the other ones being shit that i've made up from fucking found footage and other cinema and see just to showcase how easy it is to create lore on the deep web do you know what i mean but as far as as far as content goes that's different uh i am there's a lot of stuff that i've been working on for a long time that's been put to the side sadly for the last few months and um, that's totally new and totally different so it's it's I can't really talk about it. It's a secret project. If all the all the regulars know what I'm talking about, but uh, that's coming soon. So you'll you'll see. Snuff. I've got an entire documentary coming on stuff. It, it's called Snuffed. Believe it or not. Uh, I think I've got a poster for it. Actually, I think I've got a picture. Hang on a second. Oh, I do. I do. I do have a picture. I do, I do. So if we go to where's starting? Stream starting, right? And then we find this image here. And then we change it. That would be super cool. And if you would just let me do that, that would be great. Nah, you're gonna be a dick about a computer, are you? Are you? Just let me change the floor. Fuck you. Fuck you. Do you know what? I'm just going to open it on the computer. You're a useless fucking bastard. Useless bastard computer. 
And that's the wrong button, Ron. That, no one wants to see that. All right, I'm just going to let this load up and then I'll show you the poster and I'll leave the poster up while I'm having my ciggy. Deal. Oh, Metal Pyro. Hello, how are you? Yeah, there you go. There you go, my lovelies. So, this is what is uh, currently in development. So, that's coming this year. I mean, I'm not giving you any any rough estimate of anything. Um, pedo priests, man. Holy shit. Can I ask if you switch to vaping because cigarettes are really not good for you? Yeah, 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 probably. That's probably a good idea. That's probably just good. To be honest with you, uh, Jolly, I don't... I don't smoke as much as a smoker. If I'm being honest, like, I'll roll something to smoke, if you know what I mean. It's, uh, jazz time is the consumption of inert plant matter. The inert plant matter. Uh, so, I, you know, I, it, it, they last a long time. Ronan Farrow is. Yes, he is. Unless he suddenly gets food poisoning, like everyone else in LA who's ever came for anyone that's to do with pedos. Uh... Vaping is bad too, yeah, yeah, it is. To be perfectly honest with you, the only form of vaping that I have any trust in is the old form of vaping through things that are called volcanoes, if anyone knows what that is. Um, it's a completely different form of vaporizing and things, so... Uh, hang on, look into Ronald Brown, he's children's show pup... Okay. Oh, children's show puppeteer already does not sound good. Like, honestly, I'm not being funny. I think I would much rather, like, I don't know the list of jobs, right, that I would rather my kids had other than puppeteer. Like, oh, man. I'm really sorry if anyone's a puppeteer. I'm really sorry. Right, Ronan Brown, let's get stuck into this. And can I also just say, Ron, you rude, rude bastard. Thank you, Miranda Boer. Thank you very much. Do I know where that dummy is from in here from earlier? No, but you can turn the light on because I am looking up this guy. Is this the right guy? I don't know if this is the right guy. Oh, Brown. Puppet. Pup, there we go. Sorry, I was the wrong. That was the wrong guy. Please, please do not go and attack Ronald Brown, mathematician. He's he's fine. He's a totally cool guy. Okay. To if you're in maths, you're in Ronald. Okay, Ronald Brown. Okay. Maths. This guy. Pedophile. Puppeteer. This guy. Bad guy. Bad guy. Yeah. Oh, man. That is a rapey puppet. Oh, man. Literally, anyone who owns those puppets, just call the police on them. Because I'm not saying these are bad people, but these puppets will turn you into bad people. I'm offended, Ron. Love puppeteer. Yeah, but not creepy fucking... This is the puppeteering I'm talking about. I'm not talking about, like, like incredible, like, Britain's Got Talent puppeteering wizardry. I'm talking about creepy bastard with his fist up some puppet's anus, right? With the... Look, I mean, these fucking puppet faces, man. Like, mmm, no, no. Form of funny opening a fantasize about online, about murdering cookie. Wow, wow. Oh yeah, he you're well yeah, you're content, mate. You are definitely content. Wow. Wow. Whoa. Was arrested last year in child pornography and conspiring to kidnap a child. <sighs> One chance sighted in a That's how I would enjoy doing wow. Wow. Good shout. Good shout there. Who was that again that said that? Miranda, thank you. That was a really good shout. Yeah, I'm definitely going to have to go into that. It is a rapey looking puppet, man. Look at that shit. I'm telling you, if I was a judge and he told me that the puppet told him to do that, I'd be like, I believe you. I mean, you're still going to jail, mate, but I believe you. I mean, I would. I'd, I'd be, I would be putting him in a cell and in the cell next to him, the puppet. Do you know what I'm saying? That's fucked. 
Like, why? Why are why are they all such creepy bastards? Do you know what I mean? My hair's drying all, like, weird and flat. It's crazy. It is crazy. I've never, I, like, I've never heard of this one, Ronald Brown. Oh! Announcements, right? So, announcements. Monday, the second phase of the Survivor's Rooms is rolling out. And I'm starting a new Instagram for reporting all this shit. People who want to send DM, pe people who are trying to email stuff to me. There'll be a team of people manning this Instagram and everything's going to go through there for the time being. Why? Because it's another, <laughs> another thing that I need to try to stay on top of all of this. Don't get me wrong, there's no shortage of volunteers. Um, helping me and all the rest of it. It's just aces in places and you're better off taking the time to uh, formulate a, a really good team, if you know what I mean. So that's what we're doing and uh, it's working. So this next phase is going to be uh, making it easier for people to report things to a larger group of people whose job it is to go through these things and prioritize everything rather than it just being me going bah! the last time i opened my emails right because i fucked up i don't know what i've done i've somehow on my main email managed to connect all of my youtube accounts so any activity on any of my youtube accounts sends me an email if someone likes a video if someone comments on a video they send me an email So just to put that in perspective, right? Like my la my first live stream on this subject's got 20,000 views, uh, has about a thousand likes and about 600 comments. So <laughs> I need to figure out how to turn that off because that was a big fuck up. Um, so my emails are just a mess. I'm renowned for, <sighs> I really, Uh, sorry, I thought you were talking to me there, Amy. I was like, when did I say I was FBI? Holy shit. Um, I can't remember what I was saying. But. Jessica Constantine, great work for the kids, man. Thank you, Jessica. I, I need to do more now. I need to mass educate younger individuals mat on the mass like i want to get some sort of like it's the word i'm looking for like yeah i can turn them off jeff i just can't fucking find the thing youtube changed everything so now that those there's that there's a there's, everything's really easily laid out but then there's this one group of options at the back of youtube right that aren't where they should be and I can't find them. And those options are things like the tags that permanently appear. All the settings that you would set for being presets for every upload. Okay. I can't find that shit. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure they're in there. I'll figure it out. Don't worry. I'll get there. I'll get there. Um, what was I talking about? I can't remember what I was talking about. Tiger King. Tiger King! You know the Tiger King's got the COVID, man. That's fucking hardcore. Uh, hang on a second. I listen, listen. I know it's in my settings. I will I will find it, trust me. It's just evading me right now. Can you teach us how to research safely like you? I could, yeah. I could I could I could put together something that is information for you to do things in a certain way online that wouldn't make me regret putting that information out there for you to do those things online everything completely legally for example how to use the deep web to search the surface web with the images and things turned off don't let anyone ever tell you who does this that you need oh i need to see the child fucking this that and the next do you fuck do you fuck pal because I've done this for years, and I'll tell you that now. I have never seen a single piece of child abuse content on the deep web when I'm doing my deep web shit, when I'm chasing pedophiles, any of that stuff. Nothing. Nothing. 
Why would I? Why the fuck would I? Jesus. Do you know what I mean? When the website on the deep web is called baby porn. Oh, I wonder what that's about. Derp, 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 derp. So I don't need to see that shit to know what that shit's about. And people can say that they do for journalistic reasons. Okay, fuck off. Fuck off. You're like the chefs that eat the little baby birds for a fucking connoiss co cuisine research. No. No. Leave the baby birds alone. Please check your e-diamond for, for dirt on J. Oh, what's J? Rose, you're on Discord, aren't you? Scroll down the list. Okay, I will do that, name Jeff. Thank you. Yeah, Karen, exactly. What well, started Ron on this journey and how long have you been doing this? Right, Ron was on YouTube for like four years making camping videos. Then, um, Solway, you're a fucking savage this evening. Thank you. Thank you. Not on Discord yet. Go and do me a favor, Rose. Go and join the Discord, okay? And, to, like, I'm always on Discord at least once once a day anyway, depending on how busy I am editing. Um, just because I'm probably going to forget. I'm not going to lie to you. I'm probably going to forget to go on Instagram this night. Ah, Jeffrey Star. Fucking go join Discord, please. If you don't mind, please join Discord. Uh, join, download Discord, um, and we'll connect on there if you can. Julian Assange. Right, hang on a second. We're going back to the old this thing, and uh, we're going here. But yeah, everyone that was concerned about the smoke, and I totally understand. It's fucking disgusting. Absolutely disgusting. As he says, roll your cigarette. Uh, but this year, I'm telling you this as well, this year is going to be the year I want to lose weight, right? I want to change my diet. I've got all that. It's going to be fucking Ron's journey through that with uh, Leo Fitz is going to be like a little... Uh... Oh, Aiko, I'm... as soon as we're done here, uh, Aiko, I'm coming to you. I know! Almost at 70k, man. What are we at? Let's have a look. I think we're at like 69.6 or something. It's crazy. Yeah, nice one, Rose, if you could, if we could. Um, and Aiko, if you can connect with Rose on uh, Discord, uh, Aiko and Nyla, that are the mods in here, are really good at cracking the whip at Ron. Yeah, 69,648. So, yeah, that's awesome. Freaking awesome, guys. I'm smashing it. Uh, so. <laughs> Joseph, I beat Yes. Yes. Uh, Ellie as well. Yeah, absolutely. Ellie, you can. You're going to. But, like, I'm talking, like, really cracking the whip, Ellie. Like, I'm talking, like, IRL whip cracking. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Hype beast. I feel you. Oh, man. My ass is falling asleep. Hang on. Oh, you motherfucker. Fuck. Oh man, whoever put that big bone in your ass was a fucking sh he, was, he was pissed that day when he was designing people. I'll tell you that much. Yeah, let's put the most sensitive part of a man's body in a thin bag hanging off the front of his groin and let's put a big bone in everyone's ass. Okay, okay, I approve. Derp. Fucking hell. There's channels on YouTube posting cooking videos and links in the description for Mick. No. Oh, FBI, you join the Discord as well. Like, I'm being serious. Like, if you really want these things dealt with, you need to help me out. Like, and again, this isn't... I, 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 let me look you in the face when I say this. I swear to God, this isn't me being a diva. This isn't a YouTube thing. This is a realistic... 
way for me to deal with the amount of information that comes through that people seriously want covered. Because so much of it's just going through the cracks, through the cracks. All I did today, all I did, right, all day, was set up all this shit, okay? It took fucking ages. Ages. Fucking ages. You know? And then I've got to do a whole day on the merch store, and then I've got to do a day on the... It's just, just a lot. It's just a lot. Um, so, if you guys can kind of work with me, even if it sounds like I'm being a dick by asking you to download an app and fucking join the Discord and then connect with someone who's not me just so that you can get stuff looked at and it's not me i swear to god it is not me being some diva fucker being like i have no time for you nothing to do with that i care and i'm really trying to put something in place that works rather than me being like hey man i've set up i set up a new email man and then two days later there's 900 emails in it do you know what i mean do you see what i'm saying so what I want to do is I want to put an Instagram together, put a, a, a staff on the Instagram, and then it's just fucking, here we go. Star Fox and Ellie. Yeah, it's always good to see. It's always good to see you too, Bobby. Sexy bastard. Discord's worth happening, uh, having, Bonnie, if you're on our Discord. Like, our Discord's great. Um, it's great. It's a, it's a really good community. Um, really, really good. Uh, don't get me wrong, there's... It's the same with everywhere. It's kind of like the same as having a dog, Bonnie, right? Like, you can have a really, 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 really nasty breed of dog, have a good owner, and it'd be a lovely dog. But if you want a vicious, fucking, toxic bastard of a dog, you can do that with Discord. Do you know what I mean? But we don't have that. We've got a nice community. And... Uh, it matters like it's the surviving life family it's not a cheat that's not i didn't call I, I at no point have i given the army names to anything on here i've wanted it to be like an organic community thing you know so the surviving life sl family the sl fam is that's how the community feels about the community that's not some brand if that makes sense that makes sense and i feel bad at not being able to be a, a bigger part every day on it to be perfectly honest with you bonnie then yeah come and join us like if you guys have if any of you are just fucking lonely and bored come and join us if any of you have got issues or you have just got worries or woes or you just want to be around people that aren't a bunch of cunts or you're sick of scrolling in your fucking facebook fucking thing come and join us great it's awesome and uh yeah you know i wish i could be doing more though and there's just so much going on with content and trying to push the channel forward it's so business end boring right now in my life but it's all the stuff that has to be done it has to be done like it has to be done like I don't want to be that asshole that became complacent at like 60,000 subscribers and gets all big headed about 60,000 subscribers. I want to be pushing and really turning all of this and everyone's hard work into proper the fucking word advocates, advocates for child safety, for women and men's safety when it comes to grooming when it comes to trafficking when it comes to the biggest criminal market in the world the sex trafficking industry everyone needs up to date information on the realities you ever been to university i went to university got two degrees and as a matter of fact right not once were they teaching us industry industry standard it was always a couple of years behind makes no fucking sense you know so we want things up to date and live we want it to be a like a living criteria that we put forward do you know what i mean so and i've got this overwhelming desire to want to go back to my high school and do a guinea run like a guinea pig run on it also tiffin bean just tipped 421 thank you i don't know why that didn't appear i don't know why stream elements is telling us either 
Why, like, what are you getting involved for, Stream Elements? Hmm? But thank you very, 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 very much. Uh, can't find the Discord handle. Okay, so the Discord link should be in the... Hang on, it's in, it's in the link tree. Everything's in the link tree. Let me just make sure it works. Hang on. Down, 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 down. Mixer, join us on Discord. Click that. Yeah, that all works. So if you go to the link tree, you scroll down, and in there you will find... You will find the Discord link. And the reason that everything is in the link tree is so that if we have a security risk, I can shut down all of the active entry codes and then I only have to update it in one place. So that's why we use the link tree. Again, it's not me being a diva, okay? It's just if I was to go and buy a URL for a website, it's very easy for bad people to trace the person's address of who owns the website. So that's why I use link tree. And I can hear one of my children crying. Is Rachel still awake? Yes, she is. All right. Um, what I need to do, Ron, you... Do you see me? I see you, Ellie. Yeah, why? Typo. Yes, Laron. Thanks for being here. Ellie, what did I miss? Animal safety. What do you mean? Animal safety. No. Oh. Guys, we want that kitty safe. Oh. Kitty. Oh, you mean how to keep your kids safe? The child safety video, please. Oh, about the, the Google and shit. How to keep your kids' app, your kids' devices safe. Don't <laughs> If you mean the one on how to use the Google stuff, absolutely. Just let me know if that's the one you're talking about, because I've spoken about that loads. Uh, no, it's all good. Uh, Rach has got her. Yeah, so uh, if you mean the video on child safety where we're talking about how... Yes, that's fine. Absolutely. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Now... I will do that over this weekend. It's really not difficult. So I will 100% put that together. It all comes down to effectively reprogramming your mind to think. You think that if you use your Google address, you've got more control, but you need to set up addresses and profiles for your kids that are real, real so that Google can activate certain settings that gives you control over them. For example, Apple will not give you parental control over a child who's over 14. Apple consider 14 year olds fully fledged adults. <laughs> but if you're on Google, you know, if you're using uh, if you're using Android, you've got a lot more, a lot more options, basically. But uh, yeah. Yeah, in fact, I can I can do I, what I'll do is I'll do that and I'll maybe tie in like a, a quick five, six minute bit, just refreshing everyone on sextortion and the do's and, and, you know, webcam safety. And I'll just do like a little refresher. Yeah, no problem. No problem. I really feel like Ron Swanson, your mum and dad's favorite YouTuber, is the slogan that's working for me <laughs> right now. I feel like that that just nails everything it just encapsulates me and i'm so happy to be like all the kids parents favorite youtuber do you know what i mean my audience is not ch ch kids like i don't have the jake paul fucking audience i've got their mums and dads which is what we want oh i'm, co I'm coming for tiktok i'm coming for tiktok see that See that TikTok? That's coming for you. You're going to get the winkle, the old winkle finger. Let 
just chatting shit with the chat here. There's another thing that parents need to do as well, and it's it's a psychological change because the argument that you'll have between conservative parents, and when I say conservative, I mean, I'm a conservative parent. My children can't do fucking anything digitally without me knowing everything, but they're young. They're like, you know, six, five, like six, six, almost four. Do you know what I mean? So it's not like skilled hacker teenagers yet. Um, where was I going with this? Yeah, it can be difficult, more difficult, obviously, with teenagers. They can get around a lot more. Um, but you need to change your mindset, okay? So you need to stop... So liberal liberal parents will say i don't want to invade my kids privacy and this is usually when we're into the 14 and in the, in the uk you're an adult at 16 you can join the army at 16 you have sex at 16 you're a fucking man at 16 get the fuck out get a job get the fuck out you're a man at 16 all right so i'm just going to talk in uk language just now all right so a lot of parents who have teenage kids don't want to invade the privacy. And there's two types of non-privacy invaders, invaders. There's lazy cunts who use that as a way to not have to do a fucking thing. Then you've got the actual parents who are, who, who believe they have really, really, really well-adjusted kids that they don't want to intrude on. Okay, so I do not have that mindset. What I have is I take away invasion of privacy and replace it with anti-rape barrier. Okay? I couldn't give a fuck about my kid's privacy when I'm replacing that with an anti-rape barrier. All right? Big old invisible shield wall of dad's anti-rape capabilities. All right? That's the mindset you need to adopt. It's not about invading your kid's pride. No one gives a fucking shit, right? What your 14-year-old daughter and her 14-year-old daughter pal are talking about their concert K-pop shite, okay? No one cares, okay? What we care about are the people who add you as friends that we need to approve, okay? And that's really about it. Like, if you know everyone who's at the party, what's the problem? And, and parents that are like, oh, well, you need to give them freedom. Okay, nay bother, you give them freedom. Treat the internet like Walmart. How, when was the last time you left your 10-year-old child alone at Walmart? Or your, your five-year-old alone at Walmart while well, you fucked off? Never. So why would you do it on the internet? Why would you give a, a five-year-old a non-secure tablet? Shut up. It's not on. It's so easy to fall into the trap of handing your kid your phone that has all of your adult settings. It thinks you're an adult. It knows you're an adult. It's got payment gateways on it. They can download whatever the fuck they want. Did we just have... Did I just miss another thing? I did. What is, what is that? Hang on a second. Tiffin been donated. Oops, I use Stream Elements, lol. I mentioned your channel to my therapist and she told me she's heard of you. What? <laughs> That was an amazing moment. Just want to let you know, much love to you, Ron. Wow. Shit. Should I be worried about that? Big shout out to you and your therapist, all right? And I hope one day your therapist sees this, all right? Love you. Thank you for the support. Yes. So when you hand your kid your phone, in those moments where it's like, shut the fuck up! Take the phone! Do you know what I mean? We've all been there. We've all been there. And don't get me wrong, 15 minutes while you're sat beside them in a waiting room to calm them down no problem you're there you're watching it's fine okay that's okay but what's not okay is if you're coming from work you hand your kid your phone or your tablet will you go into another room and make dinner or binge my content yeah and they're in another room and you can't see what's going on you wouldn't do it with a bunch of strangers all right 
You wouldn't do it with a supermarket. So that's the mindset we need to adjust towards the internet. And anyone that wants to criticize that, just verbally tell them to go and fuck themselves, okay? This shit is too complicated for people to be coming along and going, eh, me, 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 fuck off, okay? Go and share your opinion elsewhere. I need to get all these people securing their kids' fucking phones. And then once I've managed to get, do you know what it's going to be like? Do you know what it's going to be like? I'm going to have so many comments from people that are like, hey, I've managed to get to step three of this and I haven't managed to fucking get, get this to, do you know what it's going to be like? You know when my mum, right, who's like, like, my mum will phone me and I've got to explain to her how to log into Skype or like how to upload to something to Facebook and it's like, Aah! that's what it's going to be like. But it's, I'm here for you guys. I'm here for you. But we'll get this, we'll get this, and we'll get you guys telling your friends and their friends, and they'll tell two friends, and then before you know it, everyone will have full control over their children, and every kid in the country will fucking hate me. Yeah! At least you're safe, kids. Thank me when you make it to like 21 and everything's cool. All right? So also next week we can look at Things you can buy on eBay that your kids won't know you've sewn into their clothes that are actually tracking beacons. All right. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. <laughs> my kids are totally fine. Do you know, the only people that are more screwed than my kids as they get older are the people responsible in educational facilities for my children. There are so many people that work for my kids' school, they're fucking terrified. Terrified. Of me, like, just dropping a video. Like, if they fuck up my kids, if anything goes wrong with my kids, I made it fucking clear to them. Anything goes wrong with my kids. That's what'll happen. I don't fuck around. Like, I really don't. There's no point. My mum is very low tech, it's so funny. Yeah, listen, my mum has done her first two two year phone contract with a smartphone and she's nailed it. I mean, absolutely nailed it, right? I'm so proud of her. And now she's ready for like a really good smartphone. Do you know what I mean? But man, that was a long fucking journey, mum. I'm telling you, I know you watched this shit back, but it was a long fucking road, but you got there. I'm proud of you, proud of you. I used to tell her that you had to rewind DVDs when the DVD players first came out. Do you remember having to rewind VHSs, kids? A big fucking shout out if you remember. Do you remember how pissed off you used to be if you rented a movie and the fuckers hadn't rewound it? And you were like, just fuck. That was fucking, that was, that was the realness, man. We heard you at the window, Ron. We know you don't fuck about. They were loud and they were not social distancing, okay? Like, don't be having your pals round and then be drunk in your fucking garden at two in the morning shouting abuse when you've got three young kids in the house and I'm fucking live streaming. You'll get the, you'll get the fucking, you'll get the horns, you'll. Yeah, show us how to prep iPads and sex. So yeah, that's no problem. No problem. Yeah, it's, it's really, 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 really simple. When you're 21, kids. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Please be kind. Do you remember those days, though, man? The rewinding and shit. Yeah, well, I used to tell my mum for years. She thought, she, like, I told her she had to rewind the DVDs. Brilliant. It's brilliant. She falls for it so beautifully. Do you know, Dragul, I've got an interesting story about Betamax. Do you know that Betamax was actually the better of the two? Out of VHS and Betamax, Betamax was better. But Betamax was owned by Sony, and Sony have a strict no-porno policy. Por Sony will have nothing to do with porn. And because they had nothing to do with porn, their 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 Betamax was redundant. Because everybody wanted porn! So, fun, f there you go. That's the story of why Betamax died out, man. You know? Fun fact! Might come up in a pub quiz. Might win you some money one day. Do you know what I mean? But that's why Betamax died out because of Sony's strict no porn policy. 
I don't know why I know all this shit. I really don't. I don't know where all this shit comes from. Rewind <laughs> DVDs, that's so cruel. Oh, God. Blockbuster, man. Could you imagine? Do you remember? Do you remember how fucking popping Blockbuster was for like three, four years before the i the the iStore came out? <laughs> and then Netflix came out and just wrecked that poor bastard's existence. How could they not have seen that coming? Why was Block? Why didn't Blockbuster just instantly transition into ne what net Blockbuster should have been Netflix? Do you know what I mean? Do you know what I'm saying? Someone fucked up a blockbuster. Do you remember playing six quid to rent a video? Do you know what really? Do you know what really fucking used to get me going was the independent video stores. We had them in Edinburgh, and you'd go into them, and literally ninety percent of the stuff in there, there was not a word of English spoken. And I'm not against foreign cinema. I've just hadn't reached that part of my life yet when VHSs were still available. When you literally, as I mean, I remember all week being like, I'm gonna stay over at my pal's house this fucking Friday. We're gonna get fucking some inert plant matter and rent a fucking movie. And you weren't even guaranteed to get the movie you wanted. Get that into your fucking head, kids. Imagine, imagine, right? Limited amount of something. First come, first served. Could you imagine that shit? So, I mean, some, some weekends you would wait and wait and wait and you'd be pumped and you'd get to the video store and they wouldn't have the movie you wanted and you would fucking lose your shit. You all remember. Everyone has had that happen to you. Does anyone else remember? I remember when I was a kid, you could order like 10, 10 movies or 10 CDs or some shit for a pound and then they would just keep sending you random shit in the mail that you had to pay for. Did I, is that something I made up or was that a real thing? I'm pretty sure that was a real thing. Ah. Decompression conversation. Um, in all honesty, I, do need, I need to wind the stream down because I need to go and phone Ico and get this uh, email stuff done. So, listen, everyone... Um, Thank you so, so much for the support and the, the, the donations, the super chats, absolutely everything this evening. It's a little bit overwhelming when it when that sort of thing happens. And it's all going to good use, I promise you. There's no, there's never any dicking around. Anything that um, we need for living and the kids and everything like that, uh, obviously we do, we don't, there's no... Mad luxuries for mum and dad or anything like that. It all gets spent on things that are needed and pushing the channel forward. And I just want to thank everyone who's able to support because you don't have to financially do anything. There's been a lot of things online recently about streamers who are screaming at their fans and their subscribers for not subscribing financially. It's confusing for YouTubers because on every other platform you... When you subscribe, you pay for it. But when you follow it, it's free. So really, they're talking about paid subscriptions. And they've been screaming at their fans and doing all kinds of horrible shit. Just please just watch my videos. Please subscribe. Please leave a like and a comment and maybe tell a friend. If I drop an advert for like a fucking documentary and it's going to be out in a couple of weeks or something like that, maybe like invite a few friends over and have a bottle of wine and get a pizza. Um... Maybe I'll get, maybe I'll try and get a Domino's code so that everyone can get discount pizza. That's what we'll try and do. Like, just do stuff like that. It really, when, we're, when I feel like we're all gathered in this together, it really, it just, it, 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 it's why I want, to, it's, that's what makes me want to do this. Don't ever think like you need to, you need to pay to ask a question or anything like that. If you've got f expendable, expendable stuff, financial anything fair enough but don't ever think you need to give give up something in your life to you know ask a fucking super chat question or anything like that it's just not how i am at all um and i appreciate every freaking goddamn cent and dollar that comes in i really do duck hunt oh <gasps> 
Oh, Dark Hunt. Yeah, I think I think Domino's is a good one because I think Domino's is fucking like McDonald's, ain't it? It's like if you were walk long enough in the desert, no pizza, please. Listen, I get I get it now. Shit, okay. Listen, I'm not letting the pedophiles win. All right, we're all still allowed to have pizza. Okay. All right, but we're just not gonna we're not gonna talk about the dairy product on top of it. We're just gonna talk about delicious pizza. Pedos aren't getting it. They're not getting it. They can fuck off. Fuck off. Anytime you feel like, oh no, I can't do that because the fucking goddamn pedos have stolen that from us. No! No! We take it back! Nazis can keep the swastika. They really fucked that proper. Like it'll be. Whew. Oh man. I just blew that everywhere. Fuck. Yeah, the Nazis. Yeah, like the Nazis proper fuck the swastika. Like proper style but we can take shit back from those fucking pedo bastards do you know what i mean fucking taking the pizza away from me motherfucker jesus that's letting them win fuck that fuck that shit it's like if anybody watched me play that the wolf among us game i'm happy to rip people's arms off and bite their faces off but i'm not going to do it because some fucking dickhead fucking thinks that they can use me as a pawn to do their shit fuck that so now we're taking the pizza back. Fuck it, motherfuckers, stupid bastards. Eh? I think they fucking rule the world. These elitist fucking gonards. Straight. I mean, I'm not saying that I could beat them, but I'm telling you now, I'll bite something off of one of them and swallow it. So when you find my body, you check inside the stomach for like the the missing finger of Hillary Clinton. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Do you know what I'm saying? I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. <laughs> suddenly, suddenly the budget for my new studio goes up to like 1.7 billion because I'm building it in the ground in a bunker. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Fucking hell. I can't wait for this new studio though. I'm really, really excited about that. Right, hang on a second. Manual filter. <laughs> All right. Uh, so what I am going to do, though, which is going to be quite funny, is all the banned videos that I'm doing, there's three of them, the three banned videos that I'm redoing, I'm going to redo them exactly how I think they need to be to be monetized, to try and monetize the banned, the banned series. Just, just for my own, like, weird getting one over on the algorithm fetish that I have. To be honest with you. Well, thank you, everybody. Thank you. Thank you to all of you. Yes. Although we should probably word it a bit different, Fruzia. You know what I mean? I'm sure there's a group of people that would actually be like, yeah, let's fuck some pedo. No. No! We mean... In fact, no, let's, let's, not, let's not stir up any hate. Let's not do that. Because not because it's not okay, but because of the algorithm. Got to watch the YouTube algorithms on, like, DEFCON 12 setting, because there's no one in work. So let's not piss off the algorithm. Everyone, every, everybody that's not part of the, the, the Peter File group, okay, they're fine. Everyone else, bad. All the Peter Files, bad, okay? Peter Files, bad. All right, Peter Files are bad. But yeah, as a YouTube content creator, I couldn't possibly condone acts of violence upon any groups of individuals, regardless of how severe their belief system is, lifestyle choices, or differences between them and myself. As a YouTube content creator, I must make that clear. Algorithm. All right, let me just jazz time this bitch. <laughs> we'll suss out some. We'll do our. We'll get our anti Peter file codes together. We'll still. <laughs> oh yes. Let's make up our own symbols and shit. Let's fucking let's let's make up our own. Let, yeah, we're yeah yeah yeah. Fuck you. Fuck you, motherfuckers. I'm coming for you.
Yeah. Th that that's not that's not clever enough. The algorithm is smarter than using numbers. Okay? It's so much smarter than all of us. <laughs> Just reading local bottoms fucking stuff. Oh, pure, yeah, yeah. Rachel did hear a noise last night and I went out. I had like, oh, where's the port? I've got some port left. Fuck yes. When I say I've got some port left, I mean it is a very small amount of port. I got so drunk last night. Where the fuck is the port? There we go. Hello! All right. Yeah, like uh, Rachel doesn't, you know, she'll she'll hear some noises and not worry about it. But like she was convinced she heard like coherent knocking patterns from down the stairs. So I literally opened my back window that leads out onto the main road and was like, listen, if any fucking bastards out there, I've got a crossbow and I'm itching to use it. It's a pandemic. So I'm assuming you're here to rob me. I will fucking put holes in you. Okay, and then I went down the stairs, I let the dog out, and me and the dog, I mean, I was a fucking out there with a loaded crossbow after half a bottle of port, shiting myself. Uh, then I had to discharge the crossbow safely. Oh, God. It was nuts. But yeah, I'm, you just, legally, legally, you've got to give them a warning, Jeff. And even then, you'll still go to jail. Wow, that is cold port. Pet files is getting a bit closer. Something that the algorithm might overlook. Yeah. Yes. No, that was the hedge trimming was last year. Hedge trimming was last year. Uh, hedge trimming was last year. But it, funnily enough, it is hedge trim season again. All right. Don't you worry. If you follow me on Snapchat, Surviving Life YT. You'll you'll see all about the great the great gardening skills of Ron. Alright. I'm telling you. Oh man. Oh, there was one night at the, oh, right at the start of the pandemic, right? Right at the start of the pandemic where everyone was doing the the, the crazy toilet roll buying. I I was shitting my pants that there was something going on. I really I mean I done two live streams teaching people how to fucking catch mice and eat them and shit if they had to. Do you know what I mean? But, oh, I literally had, Dragu, I literally have videos uploaded for if if I was to die suddenly, there's a video that would just automatically upload in a matter of months. Do you know what I mean? I've just got to keep changing the automatic upload date on it. Otherwise, you'll all get a very depressing video one day and I'll be like, what's up, everyone? And you'll be like, why did you do that? But yeah, I'm uh If we want to get down to the brass taxes of it all, like 100% understand what happens to the majority of the people who do keep picking with their winkle stick and eventually find something. But basically, I'm that fucking in my own fucking head that have you ever seen what hulk done to loki when he fought him in the avengers by picking him up by the ankles and just smashing him repeatedly off the floor that's how i see i see i'm the hulk in that scenario that's how confident you've got to be which is fine because your confidence is great but if google just sends a fucking laser drone from space to burn a hole in your brain that leaves no evidence and then the guy who comes and collects your body works for google and they're like ha ha heart attack who's gonna argue no one uh, tinfoil hats will be available in the merch store coming uh, this uh, this summer season this year's uh, summer summer attire how you doing ace frost hope you're having a wonderful night Okay, Peter flies. David Banner, David Banner, Bruce Banner. Is it? It's Bruce Banner, right? No, I don't need a punch bag. It does nothing for me. Smashing plates. 
oh kr there is something just so beautiful in taking like five dinner plates and going outside and just rage fucking slamming them into a wall i mean obviously you don't slam them into the wall with your hand but oh man oh what ron did you hear about the hack that happened on the zoom school meetings where they showed oh no doesn't surprise me man really doesn't doesn't surprise me at all and you know what it was probably done by a hacker group just for fucking lulls you know if uh, people think people, if you think that was some pedophile group then you're you know you're in the same group of people that believe you can buy murder boxes off the deep web with serial killers evidence in them because that's the one thing you want to do if you're a murderer is just sell all the evidence on the internet because that's smart do you know what i mean oh yes david bruce banner oh it's a nerd off in the side chat oh the power nerds are smashing us newbie nerders yes yes okay i will bow to your godly nerd ways i will bow as just a common muck nerd to your wisdom why is there cameras in school i don't know to be honest with you again it's one of these things jessica my last name is a comic character yes constantine the demon say oh i know all about constantine fucking possibly the best depiction of hell in uh, a movie ever was the depiction of hell in constantine uh, I don't know if you guys know the actual definition of hell, but it's you will be torn apart for all eternity in the pits of hell. Okay, so in Constantine, when, he, when it pans down through hell, you've got all these people burning for eternity in a pit of fire, right? But the demons are ripping their arms and legs and heads off. But as they're ripping their arms and legs and heads off, new arms and legs and heads just instantly grow back. And I was like, fuck! that is grim like whoa all eternity getting ripped oh man that would become testing testing as fuck because you know that the devil's going to be a fucking workhorse you know those fucking demons are getting no fucking statutory pay absolutely fuck all given about demon rights and breaks they're just going to be there slaving away pits of hell all day they've got kids you know maybe they maybe they stream do you know what I mean? No thought for demon rights in hell. I'm just putting that forward right now. It's not their fault. Not their fault. Just saying. Oh man, I'm really ranting now. <laughs> oh, I'm just saying, it was a crazy depiction, man. In that movie, I was just like, wow. 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 That is... <sighs> Ooh. It made me consider some things, but I didn't. So we're okay. I wouldn't you get used to I don't know they say that about the pain and tattoos and then they move to your next finger and it all starts again Do you know what I mean but it was a really really grim depiction that really made me think about not being a cunt so I was like I really don't want to end up there do you know what I mean? Plus, you got to remember as well, there's always that, whichever, I can't remember if it's the Catholic Church or the Protestant Church, whichever one it is that if right before you die, you can just repent and you're fine. You can just say, I repent and everything's fine. Do you know what I mean? That's probably the, the most solid all round guaranteed not to go to hell if you're crazy enough to, to go down those roads. Uh, way to do it. Just on the deathbed, repent. Everything's fine. Nailed it. It's fucked. Oh man, I wonder if that's... Is that why all the fucking priests are so fucking handsy? Because they just... Is that... Is that... Is that why it is, Ron? Oh, that's probably why it is. Fuck! Uh, the movie's called Constantine. If we're still talking about Constantine. It's fucking good, man. It's really good. It's really, really good. Why is Catholic being held for fucking... And apparently, a mod has to approve the word Catholic. <laughs> 
Everybody just start typing religions into the fucking side chat and see which ones get banned. Okay, Catholic, it's dead. You can't even do Catholic lol. All right. I wonder what other religions are banned. That's crazy. Yeah, it was a graphic novel. They tried to make a series as well. The series was all right. It was all right. And I just want to say one more time. They are NBC. No, that's not, that's not, that's not right. HBO are turning The Last of Us, the game, into a fucking series. The Last of Us, the game, into a fucking HBO series. That's amazing. You can say Hindu. You can't say Mormon. <laughs> you can't say Mormon. All right. You can't say Catholic. You can say Christian. You can't say Islam. You can't say Buddhist. Oh, wow. We're, this is going to be, the algorithm's going to be going fucking crazy right now. Going, what are they doing? What are they doing? Wow. Judaism. That is not allowed. Wow. That is weird. Scientology is not allowed. Yes. Oh, it must just be all cults. Nailed it. <laughs> Yes, Orthodox, no, Atheist, no, no, they're not allowed either. Atheist, Scientology's not allowed. This is fun. It's fun until like I wake up in the morning and have an email from Susan from uh, YouTube and goes, you were, you were inciting things. You were inciting. Everyone just start typing ice cream and puppies now just to really confuse the algorithm. Ice cream and puppies all day. Ice cream and puppies. Yes. That's crazy. But yeah. Yeah, just start slapping them with some ice cream and puppies. It's good times. Cults. <laughs> it's true. It's true. It's some crazy... Wicca. Wicca's not allowed either. What the fuck? Oh, God. This is a brilliant game. Wiccan's allowed, but Wicca isn't. Not a cult. Ice cream kittens. <laughs> oh, yes. Pagan's not allowed. Fucking hell. That's mental. That's, paganism is, but pagan isn't. Does anyone else remember that movie from like the 80s? What was it? Dragnet. And pagan stood for people against goodness and normalcy. <laughs> it's so good. Oh, excuse me. Excuse me. All right. What time is it? Okay. I need to go and phone Ico. So, thank you, everybody. First of all, excuse me, as I have a moment. Thank you, everybody that came and joined us. Uh, I think we did a good, informative first section. I had a really, I really enjoyed this chat. I really, really, really enjoy the um, the chatty part of all of this. I love connecting with all you guys. So, please make sure you come on the Discord, add me on Snapchat, all the other social medias you want to connect. That we can do that. Discord's the one. Monday, return of Into the News. Monday, second phase of the Survivors. And hopefully Monday, the launch of the new Instagram team who are going to be doing, basically taking in everything. Everything that isn't a Survivor story is going to go through a set team now, which is going to be sweet because Ron's sick and tired of people feeling like they're falling through cracks. Nazism is allowed. Oh, God damn it. Do you know what I mean? It's like uh, how Visa card wouldn't allow any donations to go through to um, WikiLeaks, but they're happy to take payments for the Ku Klux Klan. Logic. All right. So everyone that came to join us, thank you so, so much. Tomorrow night, community night, and uh, streaming on Mixer, the next part, the second part of uh, Telltale Batman. It's freaking awesome. So come and join us and... Uh, no, I need to phone Ico. I was just going to say I might, we could do something next, but I need to go and phone Ico and get this done. This is super duper 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 important. See you guys tomorrow. Um, I might do a little mixer stream in the afternoon tomorrow. Um, I've kind of got zoned into this little, it's a really simply put together. Uh, it's like, 
Does anyone remember Command and Conquer? How you've got like occupy areas and move through a world? Well, it's like a super, super duper, super duper simple version of that where you play like little dudes and Vikings and it's just a really addictive. So I might stream a bit of that tomorrow. There will be content. One of the edited re-uploads will be ready tomorrow. And what else? I don't know. Sunday, Serial Killer Sunday, second part of the Serial Killers Moors Murders is Sunday. That's what it is. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thank you so much. I love you guys. Your support's been overwhelming this evening. Um, and thank you. I love you guys and all the regulars, all the mods. Thank you for all the, the hard work you guys have done. Nyla, you're my hero. Iko, you're my hero. Just smashing it. Christina, also my hero. Smashing it. Smashing it. Big shout out to Morgs, who's moving soon. It's going to be a fucking nightmare, but yeah. Uh, love you guys. Please check out Razor Wire. Please check out Hunter Killer. Hunter Killer as well. Pretty good way to... Um, I don't know, fucking have something to do. I don't fucking know. Save your money. Just buy toilet roll. That's what I would do. You know what I mean? Right, I love you guys. I'm not going to push the button because there's no fucking point, mate, because you fucked it. That's right. Nice one.
Listen, don't tell me this is a fucking goddamn crepe fucking tutorial and then put a hole in a crepe. You fucking amateur bastard. Amateur bastard. Honestly, makes me sick. Disgusting. at the time of its fucking life mate it, got, it went fucking viral it was on the tv and everyone it was cat was fine cat was fine cat just got a fright cat did it to himself fuck in fact do you want to fucking talk about this fucking cat talking about fucking this shit this motherfucker this motherfucker did it to himself okay look at him look at him look at him nobody touches this cat he's just a fucking oh. <laughs> no 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 Cat did it to himself, okay? Cat did it. Jur, the, the, the court is adjourned. The cat did it to himself. He was a jumper. Fucking goddamn feeling bad for the cat. Cat was dumbass. Cat was dumbass. Cat was dumbass. Push the wrong button, all right? Love you. Don't you be